Hey guys, what's up? It's Tim, and in today's video, yes, I'm finally back. Uh, before I get into today's video, actually, I should explain. Recently, I've just been feeling a lack of motivation as far as making videos and just making content in general. I have a ton of gameplay saved up. I can do live comms um, pretty regularly, but I just don't feel the need, and I just feel like there's not much to talk about anyway. And so, for those reasons, I just didn't feel like making a video in the past couple of days, and uploads will be slowing down until... I either find something I'm passionate about or I regain the passion and continue to be making videos constantly. But for now, I kind of only want to when I have a ton of time, which is not uh, super frequently because previously I've been rushing a lot of videos and just, you know, making sure that I can get a video out. Uh, and you know for that reason I feel I feel like the videos have been suffering as far as quality goes and just content overall And I don't want to be a youtuber who stresses about you know content like that Especially when I'm not making money right now anyway, but with that said let's get into today's video Which is actually gonna be kind of a news article relating to apex legends as you can tell from the title so twitch bans Lithuanian apex legends cosplayer after using blackface on stream this news is very recent. I'm going to put a picture up on screen. Basically, this uh, this Lithuanian streamer named Karina uh, Martinskevich, something like that. I'm not going to try to uh, pronounce it, but uh, she has, she's on Instagram. She's on uh, Twitch, obviously. And so she cosplays as the character Lifeline during a stream on Saturday. And if you know what Lifeline looks like, obviously, if you played Apex Legends, and I'm going to show a picture right here of her cosplay, which is actually... Uh, not bad, you know, it's actually pretty good. Basically, she dyed her hair red, she got in the, you know, correct lifeline outfit, she did the pose with, like, the, the peace sign, and she colored her face black. She was using Twitch's uh, just chatting feature, apparently, as she was doing this cosplay thing, and she had an audience of, like, 100 to 200 uh, viewers. Basically, she started getting banned right when she started putting on, like, lifeline skin color. And it's not a permanent ban, but it's a 30-day ban. Basically, a lot of news and like gaming outlets picked up on this because obviously it has to do with Apex Legends, right? And they wanted to interview her. So she says, on my stream, I wanted to show the viewers how hard it is to prepare for a cosplay, how much time the makeup, costume, and other details can take. She said she was banned on Twitter and took to YouTube and made an apology video basically saying that she never wanted to make fun of or hurt anyone. And she surrounded the issue that she wasn't aware of what blackface was at the time. Basically, she was banned for engaging in hateful conducts against a person or people group for the use of blackface. Okay, so now that we got all the new stuff out of the way, let's get into my opinion on this matter. So personally, I feel like it's not worth a ban, okay? I, I think that it can be misconstrued uh, what she did, right? Because, you know, maybe she's just trying to make fun of people. You, you never really know. Maybe she's trying to mock people. Uh, you know, who look like that or something like that. But um, I feel like as a gamer, and I feel like she didn't have anything to get out of it. She didn't uh, portray them in a, in a negative light or anything like that. She basically just wanted to dress up as a video game character. Um, doing it on stream, I mean, you know, whatever. You got free time, you do you, right? Uh, most of the time, that's that kind of stuff is like reserved for like um, going to events, conventions, things like that, right? As far as intent goes, you don't really know, you know, what her true intent is. But just by guessing, just by talk, uh, not talking with her, but like reading her comments, and I, I guess just by the situation at hand, it doesn't seem like she's being racist. It doesn't seem like she wanted to offend certain groups or anything like that. But hey, we are in 2019, and anybody can take offense for any reason. So the the, the fact that Twitch wanted to shut this down isn't a huge surprise. But I feel like it just it was not super necessary. I think a 30-day ban is uh, okay. It's it's not the worst thing in the world, you know, especially because she wasn't like a huge streamer, so it's not going to take like a huge uh, hit on her income. Uh, but, you know, if she did, if that did take a huge hit, that would just be really bad, you know, for no reason too, because she's just trying to express uh, her love for a video game character and... You know, it's like if you got shut down because, like, you wore a, uh, uh, I don't know, a Ben Simmons jersey and you were not Ben Simmons race. Like, like, it, you know, it's not exactly the same, but it's just, 
it's that dumb you know what i mean it's just unnecessary you can tell the intent's not really there if she was there and you know portraying herself as like oh i'm super dumb i'm super i don't know whatever stereotypes uh for uh for that race that would be a totally different story but you know we know that she didn't really do much on stream right she kind of was just chatting um, and and her twitch stream got banned because of that so I mean, overall, that just sucks, but I, I think it was unnecessary, but I, I do want to know what you guys think. You know, do you think uh, that's okay? Do you think it's not okay? Do you think she should have gotten banned? Do you think she should have a longer ban? And uh, let me know if you've ever heard of her, because me personally, I have not. But I will say she did a good job with her cosplay. So that is going to do it for the video. I hope you enjoyed the gameplay in the background and just my commentary over this topic. Let me know if you want to see more videos like this or do you want to see more of my similar older style videos. And uh, if you enjoy the content, make sure to give it a like, subscribe if you're new to the channel. And until my next video, I will see you guys later. Have a great day, guys, once again. And peace.